You guys, I think I'm addicted. Hey guys, today I have another holler box. Okay, I was gonna be good. I was gonna stay up holler for a little while, but one of you guys knew that I was looking for the clear egg carton from the Dollar Tree and that I haven't had any luck finding it. So, sent me a message telling me that it was on hauler. So what did I do? I immediately got on hauler and I couldn't just order that. I mean, what? No. So I got sucked into looking at everything hauler had to offer since the last time I was on their app. And lo and behold, I think there's 14 things in here. Now, some of these are school supplies, so I can justify it a little bit in my head for getting this stuff. But other things are just things that I saw and I was like, that looks awesome. I want to give it a try. So, I'm going to show you everything that's in my box. Okay, first up is this 25 piece puzzle. I thought this was so cute. My daughter Rose loves lions. Her favorite color is orange because that's what color she thinks the lion is. I mean, they look orange. She has loved lions for at least two years now. We have to go to the zoo multiple, multiple times during the year so she can look at the lions along with everything else that's at our zoo. It's amazing. All right, we have a really good zoo. But I saw this puzzle and I was like, that's super cute. They, they're just now starting to really get into doing puzzles the correct way. They've always loved puzzles, but they, I've always had to help them, like all the time, putting the puzzles together, which is nice. I'm spending that quality time with them, but now they're at an age where they can figure it out on their own. So I thought I would get this for her. She's gonna be super excited when she sees this. I might save this for like a rainy day, or Christmas, or for when we start our preschool with her and things like that, but I forgot to mention, it's fuzzy. It's a fuzzy puzzle. I can see the lion mane right here. Look at that. Yeah, she's gonna like this puzzle. Okay, next up, I saw this and I thought it was really cool. I don't know if it works in my last holler box, I think I unboxed it on the vlog channel. I'll leave a link to the video up above. But I got a bear, I think, or a dog in there, and it didn't work. It didn't do what it was supposed to do. So I don't know about this one. But this is a talking crayon writer, the fun way to learn your ABCs. Hear a letter with the word and draw the word. So it does require batteries. I'll definitely show it on my vlog channel when we do use it. But I thought that was really cool. So it does already have a crayon in it down here. It's got a red crayon. So you're gonna hold it like this in color. And then it has a button. Okay, there's a button on the back that says oh, on. And it came with batteries. What? S is for snake. S is for snake. That is amazing. I love it. I love this already. So it does have the alphabet around the little microphone here. T is for tiger. That's really cute. I'm in love. Okay, I did go ahead and pick up a big thing of crayons. I think this was two, maybe three dollars. Um, I didn't price compare or anything like that. And this is before I went to Target and did some school supply shopping for the giveaway. If you guys have not seen that video, I'll leave a link up here if you are interested. I am having a giveaway going on right now full of school supplies, so check that out once you see everything I got from Holler. Um, so I did go ahead and pick this up. This does have the sharpener included, which is awesome. There's 64 crayons in here, so I picked that up. With two preschoolers, we're gonna be doing a lot of coloring. I got these just because they looked fun. So these are scented stamp markers, uh, and it says they're fruity. So it looks like a watermelon, a berry, a blueberry, grapes, uh, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be a peach or an orange. I'm going to guess a peach and then an apple. I'm trying to big, dig through all the school supplies first. All right, look at this glue. Isn't that cool? 
So this is a Twinkle Town Glitter Glues. I thought that was fun. It does say washable. Uh, there's three of them in here. They're 0.7 ounces. Yeah, I thought that was fun. Just a fun take on glue. Okay, I got some washable paints. That's the back. Here's the front. So this is by Play-Doh, which I thought was really cool. There's six colors in here. It includes a brush. Does it tell me how many ounces the paint is? I don't think so, but I mean, they're very, very small. They're not even, they're about the size of my thumb. But there's black, white, green, blue, yellow, and red. I made the mistake not too long ago. I bought some paint from Michaels and I did not, I just wasn't paying attention. I just grabbed some paint. We came home, we did an activity, and the paint was not washable. It totally ruined the girls' clothes. So those are now their paint clothes, but they were like nicer outfits and I was bummed that they were ruined. So now I gotta make sure it says washable. Got to make sure it says washable. So I picked this up, I just thought it was fun. I've never seen paint by Play-Doh before. And my kids love Play-Doh. Okay, I don't know if there's any, there's another school thing. Yes, there is. Here's another school thing. Oh, there's another one too under this one. So this is Melissa and Doug. I love this brand. They have so many fun things for kids. This is a placemat, or you could just use it as a learning mat. You don't have to keep it at your table, obviously, but it does say five years and older. So my girls are going to have, you know, some learning to do to get used to this, but why not just start with this, you know, just start so they know what they're going to be going towards. So this is trace the numbers, and I think it goes up to 100, and down here it has like 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, 1 million, and 1 billion. But what I'm gonna be working on the girls is like one line at a time. So here is one to 10. And then once they get those numbers down, it should be easier for them to get the rest of the numbers. So I thought this, this was cool. It's tracing, and then you can write it underneath. It is wipeable, so you can wash it all off. And I think both sides have the same thing on them. They have the same thing? Yeah, these are just, oh, so this side is showing you the number and then it has the trace underneath. And then on this side, it's the trace and then write it on your own. So that's really cool. It's kind of like a grow with me. Take it steps at a time. I love that. I know Melissa and Doug has more mats kind of like that. So I'm going to keep an eye out. I think I'm gonna check on Amazon. If I can find any, I'll leave a link down below if you guys are curious into looking at those as well because they are really fun for the kids. I think this is the last school supply. Yes, I got some rulers. This is a four pack. I think I paid a dollar for it. And they are jewel tones, which I love. I just love the bright colors. So there's an orange, a blue, a green, and a pink. I do have four kiddos, so now they each have their own ruler. That was all the school supplies. Here's the egg bin for my refrigerator. Oh my gosh, I am so excited about this. I don't know why either. I just love how clean eggs look when they're in containers like this, so I'm super excited. It's called a fridge and freezer bin, but I mean, I guess you could put other things in it if you wanted to. I'm obviously gonna use it for eggs though. But here is what it looks like. And I'm so excited about it that I am totally gonna put my eggs in this and then post a picture on Instagram. So if you guys wanna see random pictures from throughout my day, sometimes it's food, sometimes it's my animals, my kids, all sorts of stuff, I'll put my Instagram right here. Come on over and follow me on there. But I'm like really excited about this bin. Now for just some random other things that I saw and I was like, yeah, I could use that in my life. This is actually, I got it for my daughter and my husband. He is really bad about eating breakfast before he goes to work in the morning and he ends up eating out. Totally calling you out. Actually, he's not even watching this. He doesn't watch my videos, you guys. But he does eat out a lot for breakfast and I get after him all the time. My daughter, my oldest daughter, she just turned 13. She is really getting into cooking for herself and she loves it. She loves eggs. So this is a microwave omelet maker. I thought it was super cool. She doesn't necessarily have to use the stove. You just mix everything in this and pop it in the microwave. Let's see. It says pour half of mix. Okay, pre prepare normal omelet mix. Your eggs, your milk, your seasonings, anything else that you want in your omelet. 
and then it says pour half of the mix into each compartment, place in the microwave, cook on full power for 60 seconds. Okay, wait, I lied. You don't put your fillings in yet, like your produce and protein or whatever else you're putting in your omelet. You put that after. Add filling to one side, then close it, and then cook 30 seconds or longer if required. I'll definitely try this out and probably show it on the vlog channel. I had to get bath bombs. I feel like every single holler haul, I either have a bath bomb, a face mask, a foot mask, something. Um, I try to do some kind of pampering to myself once a week now. I got out of that for a really long time. I was in a horrible mom rut. I really don't know what else to call it. Couch potato rut? I don't know. It was bad and I was super sloppy. Definitely a lot better and I'm enjoying myself more also. So I picked up some bath bombs. Again, I'll probably, this is a two pack so I'll probably give my oldest daughter one as well. She really likes them. This is called a detox, so measurable difference. Detox cupcake bath fizzer. It has green tea and eucalyptus in it. I can't wait to smell these. I am going to be starting to actually use my planner. I bought it last year. I've skipped a couple months. I just write in it with pen. But this year, I'm going to actually decorate my planner. I'm really looking forward to it. So I saw this, I thought it was super cute, very feminine and dainty. It's just cotton lace tape. Forever in Time is the brand, and there it is right there. I just thought it was really pretty. I could use it in my planner. I could use it to wrap gifts and things like that. Uh, yeah, I guess there's enough in there to wrap like a small box, just as an extra detail on there, but for the most part, I'm using this for my planner. Next thing I got, these looked neat. I've never used anything like this before and I'm just now starting to organize my kitchen. I've been sharing that on the vlog channel um, and I use mostly Dollar Tree items or like Target items, things that are a little bit cheaper. So I saw these and I thought this would be cool. I have really old pans so they're already scratched. But better late than never, right? And especially for when I get new pans, I'll use these. These are cookware guards. It's a set of four. They're pretty thick and they have, yeah, I like these a lot. I think they're gonna work really good. So it says store your cookware without damaging. You could use them for pots, for pans, for dishes and bowls. So there it is right there. They're very, very soft and they have a little bit of a gripper, like a very soft gripper on the underside here. So there's two gray and two black in here. All right, last thing I got, and this is not how I was expecting it to come. Um, I have a couple of items that I picked up that are like as seen on TV items. Yeah, this is not what I thought at all. Like on the website or on Holler, it shows it in like an as seen on TV box. So I was gonna save this and do a review on it. I guess I still could, or I'll just share it a picture on Instagram or something. But this is called, like it doesn't even say it on the box, does it? Oh, it does, bowl light. So this thing is gonna go upstairs in the kid's bathroom. For when they have to go potty at night, there is a night light in the bathroom, but it's still pretty dark up there. That bathroom has no natural light. There's no window in it. So I thought this would be kind of fun for them too. So you just, yeah, it's just called a bowl light. You just stick it in your toilet, I guess on the side, and it like puts a little light on it. I'll definitely check it out, take a picture and add it to my Instagram or, you know, show it on the vlog or something like that. But that's what it looks like. It takes batteries, so I thought I would give it a try. Okay, that was my Holler Haul. If you guys love Holler, school supplies, random knickknacks, as seen on TV products, just anything in general at a lower price point, give this video a big thumbs up. So if you guys are new to the Holler app or website, it is a website as well. I just use the app because I'm I have my phone, it's just easier. But they do have a website. I'll leave a link down below. It is a referral link. If you guys click on it and shop through that link, I will get a little bit something as well so I can buy more stuff and I will, of course, always share with you guys. So, thank you so much for joining me today and seeing what I got at Holler. If you are new to my channel, I'd love for you to subscribe. You can hit my face up here. 
press the red button down there as long as well as the bell so you're notified when I upload which is every single day I'd love for you guys to become a part of my family here I've made a lot of really good friends since I do post every day if you missed yesterday's video I'll have a link to that in the corner here and I'll see you guys tomorrow with something new bye guys